So background noise can ruin an entire recording session and sometimes we can't avoid having it because of neighbors, street noise or just a broken wire that we didn't know about in advance. But a little background noise doesn't have to ruin hours of work, especially if the session can be repeated. In cases like this, a background noise remover can be the remedy. And I'm here to show you one that works with a single click for video and audio files alike. The AI noise remover in the Union Converter removes background noise in a bulk and here is how to use it. First, however, download the Union Converter should you not have it yet. You can get it from videoconverter.wondershare.com. Okay, now that you have it, open it up. The AI noise remover is in the audio tools menu. In the next window, just simply import all of your video and audio files with the background noise. Next, select an output folder. And finally, click on Start All. The tool will automatically remove the background noise from these clips. Now note that you have to be reasonable here because some levels of background noise are impossible to remove or if so, the quality of the rest of the audio will be compromised. Let's check out a few examples. So these are some of the clips we worked on. Now in here, there is a vacuum cleaner going on in the background and some other fan noise and computer noise, but it's something that you can still remove. So we're out here on the beach, the waves are kind of strong but the noise that the wind creates will be removable. The background noise is eliminated while keeping the speech nice and clear. Okay, let's look at some counter examples as well. The audio of this video is just completely ruined. You can barely hear the speech. Okay, I don't think you will be able to hear anything of this audio because out here on this field, it's just... And if I put it through the AI noise remover, it's still bad. Okay, I don't think you will be able to hear anything of this audio because out here on this field, so the AI noise remover is very practical, but just like with all kinds of noise removers, you need to know the limits of background noise removal in general. All in all, this tool is really, really good and easy to use, so I'd recommend you have it on your PC. But that's all, I hope you found this video helpful, and be sure to subscribe to the channel for more. Leave a like before you go, and I'm gonna thank you for watching, and I'll catch you in the next video.